It's finally time for our 11 Alive Canathon. The 40 year anniversary is kicking off this morning and you can be part of our mission to help those in need by donating cans and other non-perishable items. Yeah, we are so excited to be out there with you today. Some fresh faces are among the supporters of this year's Canathon. Greater Atlanta Christian School is one of the Canathon's the biggest supporters. Jerry Carnes live in Gwinnett County this morning to show us how those eager students are supporting the big effort this year, Jerry. Hey, good morning, and the students at Greater Atlanta Christian School are on a mission this morning. Their goal is to deliver 20,000 cans of food to the Salvation Army here in Lawrenceville. They understand that those cans will be used to fill pantries all over Metro Atlanta. The Canathon is filling their hearts with understanding. Their eyes are opening wide. Inside of this classroom at Greater Atlanta Christian School, third graders are seeing a world outside of these walls. How many of you know that you're going to get to have lunch today? Their eyes are opening to the real reason why the halls of Greater Atlanta Christian are bulging with canned goods. There's a lot of kids without food. It's sad because they don't know um, what they're going to eat for their next meal. Every year, students from Greater Atlanta Christian are among the most enthusiastic contributors to the 11 Alive Holiday Canathon. The effort begins before they can spell the word hunger. It involves classroom trips to the grocery store, buying for others while discussing hunger and gratitude. A lot of times there are things where younger students aren't able to participate. This is something they can do. They can bring in food. Uh, they can get excited about that. As the years pass, their eyes open wider and wider. Seniors Evelyn Logan and Colton Harsh have been collecting and distributing canned goods since they were in second grade. At the beginning, you only know what you've lived, but as you grow up, you start to broaden your worldview and really realize there are people that are living different lives than you. They realize now that each can they donate, each box filled with gifts for others, is a blessing to families they sometimes get to meet. It's still hard to grasp that there are people in the world that don't have as much as us, and so to be able to really go and see them and realize that they do need our help is just, um, is really eye-opening. Those eyes begin to open at such a tender age. We want to help those in need for food around the holidays because some of them really don't have any food right now. With each passing year, with each Canathon, their eyes open wider to a world of need outside of these walls. Just a little bit later this morning, the parking lot here in front of the Salvation Army in Lawrenceville will be buzzing with Canathon activity. There's always a lot of pageantry when the students from Greater Atlanta Christian arrive. We'll be here waiting and watching and hoping that they exceed that goal of 20,000 cans of food. Back to you. All right, Jerry, thank you. Kudos to those students. And we are going to be out there to receive your donations at four locations. Partnering with the Salvation Army and Publix, here is a look at the drop-off spots. Come and say hey to us when you drop off your goods. Crash, we're going to be in the ATL having a good time.